Hey guys, Darth Celestine here, and today we are back in Stoneblock. Now, where we left off yesterday, I was just managed to get out of the mining dimension, the, well, the cave system. Now, I have been back and explored it to its full and claimed any loot I could. Well, that was a long time, a long, long time. Uh, I also made the alloy kiln. And I also set up a little chicken farm. So if we just quickly drop down to here, we will see minecart running around. It's only got a couple eggs in it at the moment, but if we do look in the chest, we'll see we do have a lot of eggs. Which will be good because when, it, when I eventually get to crafting the inventory chickens, that will come into play... Inventory? Resource chickens. That will come into play massively. Now, with the alloy kill, I've already gave it a test, and I got a couple bit of brass ingots from it. And whilst I was in the caves, I found a lot of coal blocks, so I have more than enough to run the kiln. So as we see, just plop it in with some coal blocks, and... It will just make its way through until we get two bits of brass. So we're going to leave that running for a bit. As we... Oh, my immersive engineering. Oh, right. Yeah, there was a quest for the kiln, wasn't there? What do I get? An item transporter. Interesting. Um, okay, let's see what, left, what we've got left to do in here. Soul sand. You can get soul sand by combining sand, a mob soul, and some water in a mixer. Uh, after you first, you can make more by bulk haunting with a fan. Interesting. Well, we're going to quickly do that. So it said water, sand, and a mob soul. So, we gravel. Potato mask. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, this is my uh, little riches chest. Mob soul. So, like, this little chest here contains all the riches after... Like, the resource riches from after my cave explorations in that little mine system. I also did add a couple more chests, because I did end up getting- oh, how did I- okay, I missed some things apparently. I was probably just in such a rush I completely forgot to throw these items into their respective area. Oh, I don't even need to- I got sand right there. Haha. <laughs> yeah, I also did get- uh, I'm not sure which armor I should go for though. Like, that's Curse of Binding, so if I put that on I can never take those off. I also managed to get a new crossbow. Quick charge. Uh, we also got a potato cannon. So I'm going to be growing up a lot of potatoes. Uh, did I put any riches in here? Ooh, ender pearls, yeah. Uh, I, might, I might take the mana steel armor, to be honest. Because mana steel is pretty good. Oh yeah, I also got quite a few alchemical bags from the chest. Which will be uh, fun to explore when I eventually get into Project E. I also got a pillager spawn egg. Um, some mushrooms. Two enchantment tables. I don't know why I picked up the second one, I just... I did. <laughs> um... Oh, I had more spawn eggs. Oh, we know there's a different server, different spawn eggs. <laughs> when my brain just doesn't want to work today. Okay, uh, I need my buckets. Oh, yeah, I put my jar of light in the chest. It was uh, not serving its purpose very well. Okay, just dropping all of these in. And swap out all of this armor for the mana steel. There we go. 
we'll just drop the excess armor in... Put in the top chest with the mushroom. Give the mushroom a friend. Okay, you can go there too, Charcoal. I don't know why I grabbed you. Okay, now it's time to try and figure out how to make salt sand. Oh yeah, uh, I also did make quite a few more botany pots. Because I got so much gravel, uh, so much clay, that I just... I, I wanted to. I'm also growing wheat in this one. This one is the uh, hemp fibers from the hemp seed. This one is the potatoes. These two are carrots. That is more potatoes and obviously our little tree. Making sure I got plenty of resources to keep myself uh, keep myself in check. But anyways, before I lose track again, salt sand. It said water, sand, and the soul mixer. Uh, please tell me there's something easier. Please tell me there's something easier to craft than the lemon create. Ah, uh, I gotta go for create, but that takes so much stress. You know, no, I know how to do that. I know how to make something so powerful that it can run that lemon mixer. Oh, my brass! Yay! <laughs> Okay, slight detour on making soul sand. As I now need to... Oh, <laughs> uh, this is gonna be great! This is gonna be great! Okay. And I need a bunch of shafts. I'll need more, but I'm definitely... I'm gonna need more andesite for that. Uh... Oh, okay. I've got plenty of andesite here. Okay, 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 um, I need a water wheel, first off, first and foremost. Just a small one. So that is planks and a shell. Okay. Let's just do this. Okay, that's step one. Oh, hey, water wheel. <laughs> that, yeah, this is step one of, uh, of what I need. Then I need a couple small cogs. Here's the stick. I don't <laughs> need the stick. Game, please. Okay, six co six more cogs should do the trick. Um, and if I, do, I need to make more of the andesite thing, which I believe is ah okay. Memory needs to reactivate itself. How did I make it? It was either zinc. Yeah, I could make it through either the zinc nuggets or iron nuggets. So, iron nuggets. Good thing I picked up a lot in those damn cave chests. And move these ones. We got 12 andesite alloy, which can be used to craft up. Eight. How many eight shafts are they going to give me? 48! Oh, that's actually very lovely. No, I don't want to use that one. I want to use uh, this system. One. Uh, I know I need more than one. I'm not sure how many. I don't remember how many exactly I need. So we're just going to grab four. <laughs> four should be fine. Four should be fine. Okay, now let's see if I can remember how to do this. 
it's funny because I literally a couple days ago I did this on uh, this like entire thing for the mixer on uh what was it? <laughs> on the chaos server with my friends. Because I needed to use the mixer to create <laughs> I needed the mixer to create a lightsaber. I hate I know this song. I know this song. I love this song. <laughs> Sorry, I got I got distracted because I I really do love this song. <laughs> okay, so we're back in the creative sector. Let's break this open a bit. And I hope Aurora isn't being Aurora and moved herself around. I hate when she does that. I don't mean like moving when I'm moving, but I mean like changing her angle and rotating herself around. Stuff like that. Okay. Now, if I remember... It's like this, initially. We then take our water wheel, place it like that. We get a random block, so we'll just use this one bit of andesite like that. And it was a large cog wheel here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna clear this open up a little bit, just so I got some proper, proper insight to what I'm doing. Okay, so obviously I need to then place blocks along here. Which, and place a block there, which should help stop the water. Then we take the big cog and plop it there. Place a little cog there. Place the water bucket on there to start the rotation. Then... Oh, I'm up, I'm real. I don't like the create mod because it really makes me use like the full full power of my brain's capacity of memory, which rarely ever works. Okay, and I need to remember what did it go? How did it go from here? I think it was a shaft, followed by another big cogwheel. Followed by another small one down there. Or was it... No, it wasn't a small one there. There was like another big one here. Or was it? Ah, oh, I can't remember. I know it goes from that one up to that one to this one down to something. Carabas. Hmm. I mean, that's a pretty good rotation. Maybe that will do it for the mixer. I, I mean, I doubt it. And I might have to make another water, another water mill. 
couple, maybe a couple of extra water mills, but this is just a this is just a run test. Okay, it was the mixer I needed. Mix were <laughs> mechanical mixer, which is a cog, an andesite casing, and a whisk, which is a couple of andesite alloys and some iron sheets. Can be made using the engineer's hammer. But I use up all my andesite alloy, so that means we're going back down to the andesite level. Is the mixer up? Oh, the mixer is a side cog, so that means eventually I would need to rotate this. So I might. I just do that now. Like that. Okay, okay. Where's my hammer? It was, it was definitely the engineer's hammer. There it is. Right, I forgot. The engineer's hammer also works on rotating the position of blocks. Did I forget that? Okay, then it was one, two, three, four, five. And let me separate those two, so that will give us 20 pieces of the andesite alloy. Then I think it's just like this, like this. We now have some iron sheet. Wait, no, I need it to look like that. And these two. <laughs> Yay! Okay, then... I need the casing, I need the casing... Um... I have the wood, I have the wood, I know I'm fine on that. I'm just trying to find if I have an axe still or not. I do not, it appears that the Paxel... Oh yeah, no, yeah, the Paxel broke, didn't it? Hmm. Oh well, I can simply, I can make a simple fix for that. There we go. Oh, what does this one say? <gasps> the stick of truth. <laughs> the game has gifted me the power of the gods in the form of the stick of truth. Okay, place that there. Strip it. Casing. Okay. Now, forget. Is it a cog? It is a cog. Quest complete, mechanical mixer. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll complete all those quests in a second. I just need to see if this has enough power. Oh, right, no, yeah, it's got to connect to a small cog. Uh, do -ba -do -ba -do. Hmm. Should be good. Now, what I need to get down here for the mixer is a basin, if I remember correctly. A basin! Yeah, I was right. My brain did not fail me for once. Hmm, I'm actually going to see if like, I need anything specific, so... Soul... Sand. In the form of mixing, no heating required. Good. Uh, this needs water, a mob soul, and sand. Which is good, because I have all three of those requirements. Alright, let me just quickly drop the base in here. Now, I don't know if I right-click the bucket. I do. Do I? No? Okay. Uh, I'll, I'll drop the bucket in. There we go. 
I don't know why that was being awkward, but... Um, that's me, of course it's gonna be all good. Okay, the mob soul. Nope, not the cargo. And the sand. Look at this! <laughs> Mixing it up. And we now have soul sand. <laughs> uh, actually, the fact is I had to go and get the resources made that take longer than expected. Uh, okay. Um, the reward was a diamond ore. <laughs> of course. Ooh, an ender tank. Interesting. And what will I get for the mixer? Fluid transporter. I also completed a quest for the fluid transporter. Which gave me andesite casing. <laughs> oh, my stars. That is... That is brilliant. Oh yeah, so, in the resource chickens, I can craft a chicken, obviously, quick to be craft the chickens, a bunch of chickens I can craft, like the lapis, uh, lapis lazuli chicken, which is blue dye and an egg, but you think, oh, that's simple, but when you realise I need 21 mechanical crafters, which means I need 21 brass casings, which I have the brass for, but that means I also need 21 polished rose quartz, which are made from sandstoning rose quartz, which are made from redstone and cinnamon, nether quartz. Which means I'm going to have to take a trip over to the nether to get all that nether quartz, and into the caves to get the blooming redstone. Because I have a bit, but I do not have enough for 21, <laughs> 21 of those. Oh, it gave me four diamond ore! Okay, that's actually pretty cool. Okay, um... You know what, whilst, uh, whilst I'm, like... Whilst I'm available to do it... I'm just gonna drop all these into here for the second. Oh, starting server back up, I'll let that run its course. Okay, so brass, those two, and then we have the <laughs> end of flu ender tanks, which are basically just fluid tanks, really. <laughs> uh, you know what? Because like, I want to. It's kind of fun how these work. So if I place one there, and then hold on, we run over here real quick, and we just place one here next to the water. Then we take our lovely buckets. And I just start to fill up this one. Just filling it up nice and full. I didn't I didn't want to take water out, I wanted to put water in game. I'll admit I was going pretty quickly, so it might have uh, been, might have confused it a little. Here's a stick. Game, stop giving me sticks! Then... Okay, so let's, we now see that this one has nine buckets of water in it. Just to say. Stick of, stick of lies, ooh! Now we're getting into some saucy things. We have the stick of truth and the stick of lies. Yeah, and we head over to this one, and say I needed water for some reason in the house, I could just right click on this one instead of having to run all the way back over there. Oh yeah, I've also got grass seeds. Why? Because... grass. <laughs> okay, oh, wait, no, I needed the brass... Brain, please, work with me here. I know you don't like working, but still, on days like these, I need you to do your job. I wasn't going to take a sapling because... I know I don't get a lot of wood from this. Yeah, I got two. <laughs> That's not very helpful. <laughs> I'm just going to... 
until it grows. Ah! <laughs> it tried to take me down. It knew what I was doing and it wanted revenge. But I ain't going down without a fight. Okay. Uh, I'm at 18. I need 21. Oh, it's a big tree! No! Okay, where's the hotkey? Options, controls, keybinds. <laughs> okay, alt, uh, feed beast, ulti mine. I said that to Z? Nope, Z's conflicting. X, X conflicting. Comma? Comma doesn't conflict. Okay. I, I was not about to deal with that. Which is why I set up the Bane Miner. Get dunked. Get dunked on Giant Tree. Okay. So... Now that we also have... Now that we have enough wood... Oh! Just like with the others, we strip the wood, we apply the casing. It's pretty simple. I just gotta do this until I have all the brass casings I need. It's kind of nice how they merge together like this, though. Would make for a really good flooring. Oh. He jumped in the gun there a bit, Log. Uh oh. Wrong block. <laughs> Wrong block. Okay. Oh, right, yeah. First, I need to do this. No, not again! <laughs> Can we just do this? <laughs> Go gather up all these because I am not losing any of those to any form of clear lag shenanigan. Okay, that's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Wait, no, I should only need ten. No, no, I need, I do need eleven. My brain stopped working there for a second, as usual. I mean, like, look how cool the brass casings look. That would make a brilliant floor. Or even a wall pattern. Or even a roof pattern, actually gives me an idea for... Chaos. <laughs> So thank you, Stone Block. You just gave me an idea for how to just essentially get everything I need. Hmm. You know, I'm gonna say that is a good place to end this episode off. I completed challenges. I increased. I could now technically connect these things up to different things and make them run automatically. I might do that off screen though. Save you guys the hassle of watching me have to make a gearbox to, uh, to try and do these. Actually, the gearbox might not be too bad. I always forget, I think it's andesite and oh, a bunch of cogs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's gonna be an off uh, offline job then. Oh, just look at look at the uh, look at the kiln through the shadow, like through the grass. It looks out of place to high hell. <laughs> Hold on, let's try to. Yeah, there we go. That's got that looking good. <laughs> Especially with the mana steel armor, like that's pretty dope. Hold on. Especially when we look at like the helmet, but 
Now the helmet just looks like I have uh, something questionable on my uh, on my head. So we're gonna go without the helmet on. Let's just right. Okay, that never works. No, not video settings. Chat settings. Capacity. Size. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> But anyways guys, thank you so much for joining me today, it does mean a lot for all the support you've been giving, and if you did enjoy- Oh, Aurora's not been there. Oh, Aurora's gone. I'll deal with her later. But if you did enjoy, please do consider liking and subscribing, it does mean a lot to me. As it <laughs> just gives me a lot of motivation for the things I do, and makes me feel appreciated. Yeah. As always guys, Darth Celestian. Signing out.